far away from everywhere. With a bunch of mighty little critters, they're called the pawpaw bears. These are brave and fearless pawpaws, as everyone well knows. When you get in trouble, and this goes double, you call the pawpaw bear. Pawpaw bears, pawpaw bears. Pawpaws pop up all around like magic. They're there. The troubles that you thought you had have vanished in the air. So don't forget those pawpaws. They'll come from everywhere. If you get in trouble and this goes double, you call the pawpaw bears. Pawpaw bears. Next. It's your turn, Brave Paw. Okay, it's bombs away. Whee! I guess the princess is next, huh? Oh no, that's medicine for. Coming true, friend. Yay! Short Feather, where are you? Short Feather, your brother's flying. How about you? If he keeps acting that way, he'll never learn. If the princess is next, it could mess up the master's plan. You're next, princess, and I'll be there to grab the moonstone. <laughs> Why don't you go next, Trembly Paw? You'll love it. No, 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 that's that's okay. Age, age before beauty. I mean, oops. <laughs> now, isn't that fun? Whoa! That's gotta be her. <laughs> the Moonstone will soon be mine! Why can't I hold the front side? There is no front side to a circle, nitwit. Only the outside and the inside. You're trying to confuse me again. I've got you, princess. That's the master. Quick, the net. Hey, you're not the princess. And neither are you. Yeah! <laughs> and they call this fun. This isn't my day. No way. You and that princess, I've had it with you. That was exactly my umpteenth idea for stealing the Moonstone, and it failed. Yo! The princess oh. is too oh. tricky, boss. Uh, maybe you need to change your tactics, so oh. horribly hurt and hopper. I know. I've got to change my tactics. Maybe go after the other Moonstone, the one around the totem bear's neck. I've got an idea. I'll go after the other Moonstone, the one around the totem bear's neck. Good thinking, old master of Moonstone mischief. Uh, I don't get it, boss. If I have Mighty Totem's Moonstone, then the princess can't make him work, and we take over Pawpaw Village. Oh. <laughs> I'm amazed at my own brilliance. <laughs> okay, you big, ugly hunk of wood. I'm gonna chop you down to size. Run it out, boss. You can't miss, old panting pole vaulter. <laughs> This couldn't be easier. Hey, what gives down there? No! <laughs> Ready to fire when you are, master. Don't rush me. I'm on target. Fire. Fire. I said fire. Fire. Fire! Is Bumblepaw out of my way? He's way over there, Master. He won't botch this up. I can't move, right? Don't move an inch. Stay right where you are. Okay, boss. I'm a frozen statue. 
anything to help. I've got it. I've got it. Yo! Yo! Oh, 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 oh. You forgot your tail, boss. Go fly a kite. You just did that, oh terrible tail-spinning tyrant. This calls for professional help, and that means Aunt Pruny. Great idea, and it was yours. And you're desperate. Who cares whose idea it is? Are you sick, Short Feather? I wish you could tell me what's wrong. Make way, coming through. <laughs> Have no fear. <clears throat> Medicine Paw is here. You called? You got a sick cold? No, no. I've got a colt, a little horse. You're a little horse? My, my. I'll fix that in a jiffy. It's my colt, Short Feather. He can't fly. Might be an allergy or bad feet or ran out of sparkles. Ah, uh, now let's see. Stick out your tongue, young fella. Hmm. Ah. Hmm. So far, so good. Now for the reflexes. I'd say the little fella's reflexes pack a wallop. Gotta listen to his heart and lungs. Morning. Don't worry, Short Feather. We'll find a cure for you. <laughs> Short Feather, it's it's none of my business, but I I got an idea what the problem is. <laughs> Are you just too scared to fly? Oh, uh, don't don't be embarrassed. Sometimes I'm a little uh, scared myself. <laughs> Not much, but a little. <laughs> Maybe we can work on it together. Oh, oh, just one thing. I won't tell on you, and you don't tell on me. <laughs> you poof puddinghead, stay outside. Oh, thank you, your kindness. Yeah, you'd never get me in there anyway. And Bruni, it's your loving nephew. <laughs> Finally out tricked her. <laughs> Just isn't my day. <laughs> well, look what the black cat dragged in. You must have been sick, and that's the reason you haven't come by any sooner. Yeah, that's it, Aunt Bruni. Good. Then I got just the cure for you. Smoked skunk cabbage soup. Oh. I'm up. In a hurry. And I need a favor from you, Auntie. Favors? Favors? Am I just here for favors? When will you ever do anything for yourself? I will. I will. Why don't you help me steal the mighty Totem's Moonstone? Ugly, please. Cut the flattery and get off your knees. I just spread new dust on that rug. Until you learn to help yourself. I won't lift a finger to help you. Except this once. I'll be watching you. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Aunt Prudy. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Yo! What's she gonna do for us, boss? Nothing. I've gotta steal the Moonstone using my own ideas. So come on, let's have some. Ooh, we could plant a tree and wait till it grows tall enough to reach the Moonstone. Nah, that'll take too long, banana brain. We could climb up using ropes and scaffolding and, uh... No, 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 too dangerous. Well, uh, Master Boss, uh, hmm. the only thing tall enough would be another totem. I've got it. The only thing tall enough would be another totem. And Prudy, if you're watching, that was my idea. I'll reach the Moonstone by building my very own Dark Paw Totem. <laughs> All right, group, I picked you because you're the best. Are you ready, Beaver? All set, boss. I'm depending on you, um, uh...
And you, General McMight? All troops present and hungry, sir! Then start phase one of Operation Totem, now! Yeehaw! <laughs> right on schedule. The tree will fall exactly... Uh-oh. Uh, if that's thunder, we better hurry before the rain. Now, this'll be easy, Short Feather. I'm just gonna lift you up and slide you across this clothesline, so you'll get the feel of flying. Oh. Three, two, one, lift off! No! No! I can't! Hold you! Stay still! Was that easy? Or was that easy? Begin phase two, tunneling, now! That's it, troops! Cut your teeth into it! I just love the smell of sawdust in the morning! These pawpaws are really in for a surprise. <laughs> Put me down! Stop! I say stop! Stop, I say! Doing rock of fucking termites get a big product so I can get a mess. Oh, this will be much safer. The fan and balloons will give you the feeling of flying without really leaving the ground. Under control. Yeah! I can't hold this pose much longer. But Master, you can't rush on. <laughs> My dark paw totem is finished. It sure is ugly, boss. Ugly? I've never seen anything more beautiful. Get inside. All right, you two. I want full power to the legs. <laughs> Give me more forward motion. I need more control in the legs. Get down there, Bumble. Why always me? That doesn't do it. Slippery paw, get down there in the other leg and get this going someplace. Uh oh, sure, great engineering expert. More power! More power! More power! Just look at him, Smokey. He's finally using his half a brain. But he's such an amateur. I'll show him how to do this right. Well, I call power. Won't 
Stone, here we come! <laughs> What is it, Wise Paw? You don't have to be wise to guess it's Dark Paw. It's heading for the Mighty Totem. Let's hope the princess can stop him. <laughs> this time, nothing will stop me. drop in any time. So from all of us, thank you Trembly Paw and Short Feather for saving the magic moonstone and the mighty totem and our village. Uh, it weren't nothing really. <laughs> Heck, flying and being a hero is easy once you get used to it. Uh, uh, whoa! What? And, and I will be any minute now! I hope! Easy, easy, and the 